The federal government has acknowledged child sexual abuse survivors have been kept waiting too long for financial compensation as it releases the latest figures on the National Redress Scheme. Alexandra Beach reports. The scheme has received about 6,600 applications so far, but only 1,600 payments have been made. Social Services Minister Anne Rustin says the scheme's governance board is focusing on improving application times. There's been a number of changes that have occurred in the last few months so that we can accelerate this process. We have seen a significant acceleration. Labor's social services spokeswoman Linda Burney is calling for elderly or sick survivors to be able to access early payments. We're hearing from individuals who are worried they won't live long enough to see redress. Labor also wants the cap on payments lifted to $200,000.